السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته شيخ وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته um, in theory if someone um, commits kufr like by also like um, not praying and also committing kufr and obviously the broker will do it in, during that time if they want to accept Islam do they say the shahada and then make a ghusl because they need to make a ghusl make wudu and then go pray will this be sufficient for them to accept Islam <clears throat> a lot of the Muslims nowadays ask about committing kufr. And so many of my counseling sessions revolve around, Sheikh, I committed kufr. And I accepted Islam, then I committed kufr. And this is not Islam. The way shaitan is making you feel and think, this cannot be Islam. So before we answer such questions, we have to inquire, what is the kufr that you've committed? Sometimes people say, I passed by a church and I smiled. So I thought that this was an act of kufr, which is not. Therefore, you have to, first of all, gain knowledge and see whether what you think was kufr is actually kufr or not. But to come back to your question, if a person commits kufr, really, and he wants to accept Islam, he has to only say the shahada. And he's not obliged to perform ghusl because the most authentic opinion is ghusl is not mandatory. So if he wants to pray, he has to, after saying the shahada verbally, to perform wudu and go and pray.